Yo, what's going on guys? So I'm going to be doing a tutorial on the plugin called The Jumper. So this is a mini game. It's a pretty small mini game, but you guys can actually turn it into a big one if you spend a little bit of time on it. So basically, this mini game is just like kind of like Temple Run. You set up a runway and there are special effect blocks that when players run over it, a special effect will be given to them. So speed, dizziness, be sent back to the spawn, a jump block. So the effect blocks are really cool and make this plugin really awesome. There's science to join, science to leave. It's a pretty cool plugin. So once you guys are ready, just click on the download link here. Click download again and that will download the dot jar plugin. So once you have it downloaded, you can just drag it inside of your plugins folder. And once it's in there, you can go ahead and start up your server. My server is already started up. So once you have it ran and your server is started up, just hop on your Minecraft server and we'll set this thing up. Alright guys, so once you're in Minecraft server, you're going to want to create a runway for your players to run on. And I'll be showing you and going over the special effect blocks that make this minigame really fun. So mine is kind of small, you guys can make yours a lot bigger if you want to. But here's my starting point. And as you can see, I'm placing down some special blocks. And the special blocks are block of diamond that's the first one this one is for speed it'll let your players speed up for three to five seconds if they walk over it and the next one is a block of gold so this block of gold will make them dizzy or blind for five seconds if they walk over it. and the next one is sponge with a gold pressure plate over it this will make the players be able to jump so it's basically just like a jump block the next one is a bedrock block. This will send them all the way back to the spawn point. So I wouldn't abuse it too much. And there's another speed block there. Then the last one is the beacon block. This is the finish line. So once they cross it, the game will be over and they basically won. So once you're done with this, we're going to set the spawn point and create the signs to join and leave the game. Alright guys, so to set your spawn, you're going to want to go to your spawn point, stand at that point. And then type the command slash jumper set spawn. Hit enter. And then there we go. We have set the arena spawn. That's pretty much all we have to do because we have the finish line blocks over there. So now we're going to create our signs. You can just place your sign down wherever you want. I'm going to create my join sign right here. Now the first line you're going to want to put bracket. The jumper. Capital T. Capital J. No space. Close bracket. Now on the second line you're going to want to type join. So if you wanted to create a leave sign, you can just type leave instead of join, and then finish sign, finish instead of join. So I'm going to create my finish and leave sign over here. Jumper, finish. And then the jumper, leave. All right, there we go. And players can also use the commands slash jumper join to join in. I'm going to use the signs just for the heck of it. I'm just going to right click on this thing. And then there we go. So we can just run the course. And as you can see, I speed up pretty fast. And the next one will pretty much blind some of my pathways. So I can't really see where I'm going. And that will make me jump. As you can see, that made me jump pretty far. If you went over the bedrock one, it would send you back to the spawn. As you guys can see, I went over the beacons, so it pretty much completed the whole map for me. So there we go. We can choose our reward, which is pretty cool. These ones you can't change. Plugin developer didn't make this available yet. They might in the future, though. But that's a pretty cool future right there, 100 coins. So there we go. I now have 100 coins. And that's it for this tutorial. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, make sure to drop a like for me. And peace out, guys. Uh